Hi, I'm Bill the Piano Tuner. Thanks for joining me today. For those of you who have been following this series I'm doing on the piano action and their fun parts and functions, you're probably getting tired of seeing this action model, but I have one last thing to show you. What I'm going to discuss now is aftertouch. What aftertouch is, is when you press down the key and the hammer goes back and gets caught by the back check, there should be a slight amount of motion to the left in the key. That's called aftertouch. Without aftertouch, the piano is laborious to play and it makes your fingers and hands very tired quickly. Now, we're going to go over to the piano and we'll review everything that there is to, to check when looking for a used piano. Hi, now we're over by the piano and I want to review everything we've talked about in this series. The first thing you want to do when you're checking an old piano is to play each key. All the way from the bottom to the top. Now what you're listening for is buzzing, rattling, strange sounds. If you have any problems like that, don't buy the piano. Now the next thing we want to do is check for key bushings. You take your finger and you rub it across the front. You hear that clattering? That means that the piano needs new key bushings. The other thing is to check for chucking. Remember you hold the key, push it forward and back. There's no play in this, these keys. The piano doesn't need chucking repair. Now if you want to check the capsules, you push lightly on the key. Remember if the key goes down a bit and then you feel a heavier feel to the key, it needs caps and adjustment. Now let's look inside the piano. The first thing you want to do is check to see that the bridle straps are good. See those green cords in there? They're bridle straps. And they're not broken. They're in good shape. This piano does not need new bridle straps. Now let's look at the hammers. If you look in here, you can see that the hammers are really deeply grooved. Now when you go to the, the top hammer, you can see if the piano needs new hammers. If you notice the grooves, see how close that wood is to the point of the hammer? This piano needs new hammers. Now, after you've checked all these things out, give me a call so I can come out and check your pin block, your bridges, and your soundboard. Well, that's what I have for you today. I have the day off. I think I'm going to go and walk in the woods or just enjoy myself. I'll see you next week. Thanks again for watching.